Hi, this is Lana Lisa Williams again with video number five of my series Apocalypse Desert. I am at the prison where I taught for over nine months and I'd like to tell you another sad story. This is the prison to the left of where I taught. I used to walk all around here during lunch to get in shape and this is a long pathway that goes between the prison next to where I worked and the prison where I worked. I have been given a lockout order. I'm not welcome at the prison where I used to work, so I'm not gonna go too close to there. But I will tell you about Jose, the inmate who sent me love letters and I sent him replies, who asked me to marry him. I won't give his last name to protect him Anyway, Jose was running with a gang in Southern California. He was a teenager. When he was 17, he threatened someone, a man, with a gun, but he did not pull the trigger. So he got a long sentence for using, having a weapon in his possession, and I'm not sure what the whole thing was for assault with a deadly weapon, I guess, but he did not kill anyone, thank God. He said something kept me from pulling the trigger. He had a cold heart then, but then he went to prison. He's already been in 13 years. He just turned 31 and I'm having visitors here. So he's been in 13 years and he's got at least five more. And this is um, some lawyers going up to the prison on the left, which is the ICE prison where they have 2,000 inmates getting ready to be sent away from America. Just giving you a 360, a lot of walls around here. But this is the prison where I worked. Can you see the very long wall? Jose is somewhere in there. And there's the flag in the distance and the front gate and the parking lot where I used to sit and have my lunch because the prison is so far away. We don't have time to go to a restaurant or a market. So another 360 degree view of the prison where I worked, where Jose sits. I have asked to visit him and had no response. I've sent him a birthday card. His birth birthday was March 12th, but he didn't get it with some photos of me. He didn't get anything. He said he sent me letters. I haven't received anything. So this is kind of a sad story. And I would like Governor Newsom, our new California governor, who just kept 50 men in California inmates from being executed. He suspended execution in California because we do need prison reform. I would like Governor Newsom, to whom I have sent three letters today, I will probably send number four, to pardon Jose for a crime he did when he was only 17 so that he doesn't have to sit five more years in prison. It is hard to love a prisoner, it is hard to wait. A lot of family members come here and they visit. Look how long the prison wall goes in the apocalypse desert. You can see Joshua trees at the end. You can hear prisoners yelling on the left side of the prison. Can you see through the gate? That's what a prison looks like. Can you see in there? See how it is to live behind walls. What would it be like to make a wall on the border? How would you like to be on the wrong side of that wall? How would you like to be behind a wall with razor sharp metal covering it like the prison where I taught a GED course for nine months. I want you to just contemplate this story. This may be my last video for a while. I don't know how my story will end. If you'd like, buy some of my books. I love to live on my writing. So I think this is as close as I want to go. So this is Lana Lisa Williams signing off. I hope you liked my stories. They are true. God bless you.